Welcome to the Fly Route Pod. Whether it's your first time listening to any of our videos or your return listener, do us a favor. Please subscribe and hit that notification bell so you don't miss any of our content. The, the, the Fly Route Pod. The Fly Route Pod. The Fly Route Pod. That brings us to number 10. And number 10, I actually have the New York Giants. And I think the New York Giants are going to be a top 10 defense this year because. Look, the one thing that now is true that we should be able to see from last season is Joe Judge can coach his ass off, and he coached this defense to be stout last season. They allowed 5.3 yards per play last season, which was top 10 in the league. They entered last this past offseason needing a number two cornerback for sure and to get better at the pass rush. They did both of those things, and That is huge for them. The first thing that was important is that they extended Leonard Williams. Dude was an absolute monster. Had 11 and a half sacks last year. They just needed a guy to play on the opposite side of him. And they added both Danny Shelton and Ifadi Odenibo. And look, that dude has seven sacks in 2019. Great pickup in free agency. Uh, Decent play for a backup uh, and also just being able to have a bounce back year on his side, especially with having someone like Leonard Williams take a lot of the pressure off of him. A uh, sneaky guy here for this pass rush is actually Lorenzo Carter, who is back from injury from last season. And he's been a minimum of four sacks a season type guy his entire career in the NFL. And I think that adds a little bit. And while the pass rusher, Overall element of this team did not take a massive jump. I think they made a lot of little additions that bolstered the overall unit here for them. And now on the other end of things is that they finally got a legit number two guy to pair next to James Bradbury, who in and of himself is an absolute monster. They got Adoree Jackson, the former Titan, to give them a good corner next to them. But Bradbury in and of himself is by far a absolute complete monster had 14 pass breakups and three interceptions and those numbers might not sound gaudy but you have to understand that in the sense that he was only targeted 78 times so he's looking like honestly one of the best corners in the league just for volume right now 